Although I won't get Mekong in, in... Oh, fuck it. Let's just go to speed 5 and just <laughs> wait until we go to Bengal. I'll just coast until the end of the game. <clears throat> Invade GB. That sounds way too difficult. <laughs> just for the halibut. Be nice if I could have done some of these, but obviously I, uh, I've only just taken the mandate, so it's not likely. Ah oh, well. I think we're probably at the stage where infantry are a little bit. Uh, Still got a lot more shock on the cavalry, haven't we? Maybe more shock there. What about our pips? Three shock there. They still do more shock. I think it's probably Worth my while to start start building more men, many men, men. My perfectly balanced armies here. I could, hooray! I could try and figure out what composition I want my armies to be. That's always good fun. <laughs> right, let's see. Combat width is 40. Let's say we go up to 400. So, with a hun- yep, 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 yep. Four stacks of 100 each. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. That sounds good to me. So, 100, and it would be 40 cannons, and then I guess just 30, 30, 30, 30, 40, sounds good to me. <laughs> uh, so then that doubles to 200, 400, why am I imposed? There we are. 60, 60, 80. And that doubles to 120, 120, 160. <laughs> there we are. I've got too many infantry now. Too many cooks. Any ideas of the next run? Yes. And your phrasing is apt. That's all I'm saying. Da -da -da -da. I need 14 horses. What am I doing now? Whoop, too far. Let's do canic. Mechanic. Ha 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 ha. Look at these revolutionaries. Get out of here. <laughs> Where are all my armies anyway? <laughs> they're, they're all over the place. Let's bring them all around there. There we go. <clears throat> then we can sort them out. That should be everyone. I've missed someone. Who's this? 
What's he doing? Does he even exist? Where is he? Oh, what are you, what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> well, that's like fast as I've ever seen that go down. I'm astonished. I'm still making 50 ducats. <laughs> this only ever happens at the end of the game. It's so dis distressing when you have to move on to something else. <laughs> oh, I know what I'm spending this money on. Hang on. Oh, hang on. What's going on here? No, no, no. Oh, uh... How's there? Ugh, it's sunk a little bit, isn't it? Um, yes, I'm spending this money on manufactories because that's always good. <laughs> I can't. Oh, brilliant! There we are. Uh, plantation? No. Okay. Trade state? No. Okay. Does this mean it's already built? No. Yes, the blue means it's already built. Well, that makes me feel a little bit better because there was quite a few of these things knocking about all over the place. Yeah, there's a trade station. Farm is Tate or Mill. Well, the AI's got really good at building these. Fair play. <laughs> Bengal Schmengel. Hey, how was Finland doing with their revolution? I guess it finished. <laughs> Let's build some of these then instead. <laughs> I feel an like AI is good at something. The AI has got has actually got really good in uh what? In recent patches, they've really improved it a lot. What was his face? I've forgotten his name now. He left recently. Gnivom. Gnivom did a load of good work on the AI. It's just, I was really genuinely disappointed when he left. When it, they announced he was leaving Paradox, he was like, "He's done so much." Um. Spreading one stacks across the country is really good though, because they carpet siege and they actually make your life difficult. <laughs> More money. Oh, jeez, I've just built all of this. <laughs> oh well. Make that inflation go down a bit further in a minute anyway. 94 ducats a month. I don't know what to do with all this money. I, I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> have you been claiming things? No, you haven't. Have you, are you allied to anyone? Yes, you are. Forget that then. Gift it. I haven't given anyone else my hard-earned money. Ooh. I remember what I went through to get this. <laughs> Oh my god, if my tributary gets the revolution, I can't tell- you can never tell whether they're in the disaster or not, this is the problem. <laughs> I think everyone is in place. Right, let's sort this out then. Oh, do I have enough cannons? I don't think I built the cannons, did I? Oh, yeah, red. We need uh, 42 cannons, if you don't mind. <coughs> Hopefully, by the time we <laughs> by the time we go to war with Bengal, we've we've, we've sorted this out. Bolu, 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 bolu. The final boss of all my campaigns is trying to <laughs> sort my armies out. Oh, but that Diplo rep is better now. Let's see if anyone else will. Uh... Nope, just the Commonwealth. Well, there you go. Ooh. 
Debeg Borgogin. Is any good? No, not really. Well, glad that happened. Oh no! Louis oh, that's miles away. No. Was it Liu? Liu Zhu? Oh. oh, it's not miles away, that's alright. Uh, who should we send? Let's send them, because they're almost a full compliment. <laughs> this reminds me of. Uh, episode of Hancock's Half Hour. Oh, it was one of the missing Hancocks. They, they recreated it with a uh, you know, modern cast, but exactly the same script, and they were all the same way and all that. And it was this naval officer who was he got given command of a ship. <laughs> thanks, thanks for the compliment. He, um, as it were. Uh, he got given command of a ship, and he said, but there's only three of us to take the ship. It's all right, I know you can do it. Well, that's all very well, but I need a bigger compliment. Okay, then, you're the best officer in the whole Navy, and I know you can do it. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I love it. Right, uh, reach the cap of Mill again. Cap de Mille. It was only 10k peasants, I could have just built a stack of mercs. It didn't do anything anyway. Oh, the cannons are done. <laughs> well, this guy's got too, too many cannons, and he needs two horse, no, two men and one horsey. But we'll have to worry about that later. Oh, good heavens. <laughs> He needs more cannons and more horse. That's too many cannons. We'll figure this out. I've got 11 cannons going. <laughs> uh, on, how many do you need? You need four cannons. Have four cannons. Four candles. There we are. Wait, 15, 15, 20, it should be. Yeah, okay. It works. <laughs> it works. I'll take it. Now I've got seven cannons. Seven cannons. Going spare. There we are. I'm going spare at this rate. 20 cannons there. Who has no cannons? Everyone's got cannons. Ah! 10 cannons. There we are. Perfect. Oh my god, I overran the episode again. God's sake. Well, let's run on for another uh, 18 minutes. This is not canon. Oh. <laughs> now he's got too many of these. So you'll put him there. We're getting there. <laughs> Oh my god, I need to make a note of it. Uh, what episode are we on? This is the fifth one. Not... Canon. Thanks. <laughs> Who are you? Xu Chao. I'll make, I'll make a note of this. You will get fame and recognition. <laughs> <laughs> you keep saying that things are horrible and you love it. I'm getting mixed messages. <laughs> I could just tack up. Or I could sacrifice men to the manpower god. Let's do that. That guy's terrible. Where's he? Awajim Karakapokajin. There he is. Get out of there. Oh, that was a different one. Hang on. Agbarjin Karachin. Oh, it's that one. Oh, Jesus. Right, let's kill him. There we are. <laughs> He's been sacrificed. <laughs> the greater good. Uh, I've, oh, I really don't want this guy to die. He's just the best. Uh, oh, there was a second one. That's why. Let's get rid of that one. There we are. I mean, he literally is the best. He's a 6'6". Six, six. You can't get better than that. You can't explain that. Where is he anyway? 
Oh, I, dis I discontinued him, that's right. Or whatever the word is. Uh, ooh. Yes, please. Don't mind if I do. Don't, don't mind if I don't, but I will. <clears throat> Technology, indeed. Don't make me laugh. Anyway, let's let's finish this. Let's finish what we started. Like your, uh, I don't know, your Kylo Ren's. <laughs> so here we need a five five seven. There's your seven. Where can I put three cannon? Three cannons can go there. We're slowly getting there, slowly but surely. The truce will be up soon. I, see, I knew I wouldn't make it in time. <laughs> Bolu, that is all done. So, state-wise, oh, Georgian. <laughs> no. Chakas, cry. Oh, damn you, you, you vassals. Right, we'll have to do some of this. Oh, ah, no. This is the next one we want to do. Uh, state. Actually, no, this is entirely pointless because um, I don't have enough merchants to forward all the trade into Persia anyway, so let's just focus on the Persia node. Um, couldn't do Mashad, but let's double check. What is it? Minus 1.5. So, oh, I never turned that off. Wasting my money on that. Um, okay, that one's done, that one's done. That one's all done. That one's all done, that one's all done. Alright. We'll just work our way through them then. Well, we'll look at ones that look like the high dev. That one looks high dev. Let's do that one. That was easy. 27. Whole 27 admin. Uh, Force Ridges Unity, and then... Oh, Tehran. You know how they love religious unity. What music do I listen to? Do you know what? Recently, I've been obsessed with a Mongolian band, believe it or not, called Nine Treasures, who do uh, do rock. Sort of like heavy rock. I do like that. Um, so I like a lot of rock. Um, many like early 2000s rock, like your Franz Ferdinand and Kaiser Chiefs and that. But I don't really like their later stuff. I prefer their earlier stuff. Um, I like electronic music like Daft Punk, Justice. All that kind of stuff. Like, I, I never go to concerts or, like, nightclubs or raves and that, but I love dance music and... And I love, uh, you know, sort of, like, proper headbanging rock and stuff like that, like the darkness and all that. And Nine Treasures. Bloody good, mate. Uh, oh, he's got too many cannons. Literally too many cannons. One, two. Put him there. Well, figure this out. By Jove. By hook or by crook. <laughs> He's got three many horses. What what have I been to concert wise? I've been to a I've been to a status quo gig and I've been to a madness. I like madness. They're really good. That's it. That's all I've been to. I just I just, I just prefer listening to the music. I'm not really a big fan of crowds of people, <laughs> just in general. Oh no! He was actually quite decent as well. That's a shame. Oh, okay. Uh, well... We've only got 18 years left, he'll be alright. <laughs> I'm so confused by all of this. Let's just... Let's just focus on getting whole stacks done. Like, oh, what is going on here? <laughs> Good God. There we are. I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, one horse. Just give me one f fucking horse. And we'll figure it out. Wait, that's not a horse, that's a man. <laughs> Imposter. <laughs> so who has more men than they, they have any right to have? No one. Great. <laughs> we'll use the cannons as the base. So... We'll do that. He's done. 15, 15, 20. That's it. I think to choose the Bengal, but I'm too busy. We'll put him there. We'll put him separate from the others. Right, I need two men and one horse. That sounds like a very confusing video. <laughs> so it was at work we were talking about like creationism and that, and they said, have you seen that video where it's two priests and a banana? And I was like, is that a rude one? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> What sort of conversation you get me into? Did spend the whole episode microing, you'll turn into a rumba. Oh Jesus, I'm not that fucking bad. I am, I am subscribed to him, and like I looked, um, I check in, I check in on his series every now and then, and I saw one where it was like, it was episode thirty, and he was in fourteen fifty, and I was like, are you serious? I swear it's got worse. It's got a lot worse than it used to be. Right, let's take that, start reducing that inflation. That's looking good now. Tch, gold, to think when that was... That was my main source of income. Those heady days. <laughs> uh, hang on a second. Oh, he's done! Let's get him out there. Let's get him away from this place. Okay, 18 cannons. Two cannons. He also needs... Eight horses. Well, have I got a deal for you, Sonny Jim? Oh, that's not what I wanted. No, neither was that. Hang on a second. No, we need eight men. Why do I keep calling them horses? They're definitely not horses. <laughs> I should have been drilling my arms whilst I was doing this. I'm gonna... St I'm not gonna... St let's start now. No, let's not. Fuck it. He went on for 30 minutes pulling out a notepad and listening to things he wanted to change about the game. <laughs> I'll forgive him in the Ryukyu campaign because... I think that was a campaign where you actually do need to sit and micro. I think possibly that might be what has made it worse, is that he did a whole campaign doing that. And that's just made it the norm for him. Right. I need one of each. Then he's... Wait, wrong one. That one. Didn't even finish it? Seriously? I was vaguely following that. Obviously I stopped at some point. Uh, one man, one, why did I say it like that? One man, two cannons. One man, two cannons. Where was he going? He was going, that was a horse even. Why can't I, why can't I tell the difference between men and horses? <laughs> What's happened? Do I need to go to bed? <laughs> he was literally almost done. Oh, Jesus. I'll have to check out what, what he was doing with that. Well, let's get all of these together and see what we're left with. They should all add up to two stacks. <laughs> Horses aren't men. How silly of me. This Bengalese revolutionaries just keep on walking back and forth between our place. I wish they wouldn't. Perfect. Right. So we're going to have to deal with the, rev the revolutionaries and the Bengalese. Bengalese. Unfortunately, these. But uh, this was overkill just for just for them actually. Uh, we'll put them there. We'll put him there. Have they allied anyone? Oh, for fuck's sake, Malacca again. At least it won't take as long to occupy all of Bengal. How many troops do Malacca have? Malacca, uh, I have 119k, so we'll send over probably another two stacks, actually, just so they, there's no escape for them. I keep on re-allying these people, it's doing my head in. Um, this, well, he can go there. 
Well, no, let's just split this one. Put one there. We'll split. Uh, no, we'll leave him there. We'll bring him there. We'll bring him there. <clears throat> then we'll be ready. Let's take up as well because we're way ahead on all this. Get more fire and shock and all that good stuff. Ooh, we're almost at the last tech. Tech us out. That's looking lovely as well, isn't it? Oh, I can do the thing. Let's not do the thing, though. They don't really get good until the third one, unfortunately. I don't fancy being at... Well, you have to... It re removes 80 mandate, I think. Or is it 70? So, yeah, I don't want that. You've got to go up to 100 and then just do nothing for a couple of years. It's not no point. There's only 20 years. Well, 17 years left. Bar Hamburg. Did they change it to 20? I assume a thing will pop up. Yeah, here we are. No, here we are. One stab and 70 mandate. I think it used to be 80. Um... There is this thing, you lose 20 meritocracy here, that might be what you're thinking of. So I, I'll happily do that. Okay. So we'll send the 6-6 six, six down there, we'll disleaderify him. We'll stick... Uh, da -da 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 -da. The second best one there, third best one there, and we shouldn't need any others. So, Bengal, how would you like to die? Oh, Ladakh, who are all these people? Guaranteed by Malwa? Oh, for fuck's sake. Looks like we're attacking Malwa as well, boys. <laughs> Must be some other way I can do this. Ladakh. I don't want to attack the DAC. Who are they allied to? Brunei and Bengal. Oh, Yemen will join in if I do that. Yemen will join in if I do this as well. These bloody webs of alliances. I just want all of India to be red. Is that too much to ask? <laughs> When's my truce with these run out? 1810. This is fine. We'll run. We'll send these guys. We'll deal with uh, Malacca. Then we'll run and deal with Malwa separately. Uh, we'll just sort of fuck up Bengal first. We'll hang on. Where's our truce with Malwa? Run out eight and ten. If we can white piece Malwa before in it before eighteen oh five, that'll be nice. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Hit the microphone there. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Let's force march so they don't escape. That's something I bloody well hate. There we are. Yemen won't actually be that much of an issue. Uh, but, 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 I'm more worried about Malwa. Let's have a look at what we're up against. <clears throat> so it's actually Malacca that's the... Oh, Jesus, Malwa. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I forgot I took all of their best provinces. Okay, this is no problem at all, then. We're right to deal with Malacca first. This guy's four siege as well, so now watch him die on the siege. That's always the way. They will have access to all of here, unfortunately, but I have... we should be alright. Cool.
Sounds like the Hovis advert this, doesn't it? What is this? <laughs> Golden sun is rising. Well, there you are. Ah, we're going to deal with them later. Once we've occupied Bengal, we can just literally just turn these round and go and deal with Malwa. I do watch the Dev Clash, but I'm really far behind on YouTube videos at the moment because I've been streaming every night, so I haven't seen any of the new one. I love the Dev Clash. I, I so want to work for Paradox just so I can be involved in that. It's literally the only reason. <laughs> Let's use the magic button. And let's cannon it up. And let's move them off just to compensate a little bit. <laughs> I think it's the same with everyone who plays these games, isn't it? Right, well I'll uh, kill these revolutionaries and then I'll have to turn in for the night, I'm afraid. Well, we'll look by the province, just so I know where I'm at. <laughs> I've actually never played multiplayer. <laughs> I'd get, I'd bet, I'd get a little bit, I'd get curb stomped. <laughs> first chance, they, first chance they got, I reckon. Uh, that's one province, so we'll do that, we'll do that. Likewise there, we'll do that, we'll do that. Uh, these guys will keep together. Actually, we'll let someone else occupy that. We'll just move these over to here. Right, that's all for today. Uh, we can only play speed cheap because of connection. Uh, yeah, that's the problem, isn't it? Um, right. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll be back not tomorrow. Tomorrow is Digimon World Day, so I'll be back on Sunday, probably in the afternoon, for more of the same. Be nice if I could finish it on Sunday, but actually, I, I probably will finish it on Sunday, so that'd be nice. But then we'll wait wait until the twentieth to start a new campaign. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you later. I'll do the time lapse to finish off with. Bye.